Do you know what's really in your food? It's a question that might seem simple, but the answer could surprise you. With the convenience of fast food, microwavable meals, and snacks at our fingertips, many of us are consuming what scientists refer to as ultra-processed foods. These are foods that undergo extensive industrial processing and contain additives that are not only nutrient-poor, but energy-dense. Recent studies show that these ultra-processed foods may be contributing to a host of health issues, including heart disease, diabetes, and obesity. The high sugar, fat, and salt content, combined with their low nutrient density, make these foods a potential time bomb for long-term health risks. Interestingly, research has revealed a correlation between the consumption of ultra-processed foods and increased calorie intake and weight gain. These foods, despite their convenience and often irresistible taste, are leading to elevated risks of cardiovascular diseases. It's a concerning trend, particularly as these foods become increasingly prevalent in our diets. The origins of these ultra-processed foods are fascinating and perhaps a little unsettling. Did you know that tobacco companies like Philip Morris and RJ Reynolds once played a significant role in the creation of many of today's processed foods? They used their expertise in flavors and additives from cigarettes to create foods that were hyper-palatable, containing potent combinations of fat, sodium, and sugar. These foods were marketed as wholesome or low-fat, but were criticized for their high sugar content and potential to elicit binge-eating behaviors. But it's not all doom and gloom. There are steps we can take to reduce the impact of ultra-processed foods on our health. Prioritizing whole foods over processed ones is a crucial first step. Whole foods such as fruits, vegetables, lean meats, and whole grains are nutrient-dense and can contribute to a healthier lifestyle. Reading food labels can also help identify ultra-processed foods. Look for long lists of ingredients you can't pronounce and be wary of foods that claim to be low-fat or sugar-free, as these often contain other unhealthy additives to make up for the lack of flavor. So, the next time you reach for that pre-packaged snack or fast-food meal, take a moment to think about what you're really putting into your body. Remember, your health isn't just about the here and now, it's about the long-term, too and making the choice to avoid ultra-processed foods could be one of the best decisions you'll ever make. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it if y'all would share my channel to your friends and family.